Joe Biden has now signed an executive order and has declared that Russia is a national security threat to the United States. They have also rolled out a series of sanctions. Now, they're trying to say that Russia's doing this, Russia's doing that. We've heard this for years coming from this side. Now, they're calling back individuals from their posts, and it's all tied into this multi-layered executive order that is going against Russia. Now, if you missed it, Russia is sending troops and big-time equipment into the border area around Ukraine. They swoop down into Crimea, and there's not a whole lot of talk about what's being done on the other side. What we do know is this. The White House and the Treasury put these actions against Russia in the motion. They're saying that the U.S. is expelling 10 of its diplomatic personnel from the Russian embassy in Washington, which is also said to include intelligence officials. The U.S. will ban American banks from being able to buy new Russian sovereign debt starting on June 14th. So on June 14th, this thing goes into motion. And I expect we will see things escalate from here. It seems that this is what this administration likes. And this is the direction that they're heading. We also heard yesterday about all this troop thing, you know, being pulled out of Afghanistan. I'm not buying none of that. We've heard that so many times before, even under the Trump administration, and it was a shuffling of troops. Hmm. Seems you need some troops real quick, close by, in the Ukraine area. We're going to have to keep an eye on where these troops go that are set to being pulled from Afghanistan. 